What is up guys, Tom here and welcome to the second part of this vlog, I suppose. Uh, now, I thought I'd split it into two parts because it got a bit uh, kind of longer than I was expecting it to because I was just expecting everything to go alright so I'd have nothing to talk about but it didn't. It ended up getting dropped off at some random place and left until the mini boss came up and uh, so it was a bit of a pain, so I kind of explained that, so it ended up uh, being a bit longer, so I decided to split this into two parts. Now, as I'm making this, this is my third. I've got three days left, two days after this, uh, two full days, then it's time to head uh, to the airport and time for me to go home. Um, but, yeah, I forgot to do uh, anything, because nothing... Too much exciting has happened. I've literally just been spending all day on the beach. This is the first day uh, of the holiday where I'm actually not going to spend all day on the beach. And I'm going to actually go out and do something uh, in like the town or the square, whatever it's called. I'm going to go, I don't know, look for stuff, I suppose. I don't know. Um, so, I've, like I said, I've got nothing too much to say apart from, uh, I think it wasn't. Actually, yesterday, for like for the last three days, the sea has been seriously choppy. Uh, it's been like so cool to just jump over the waves and you just kind of stand there and wait for the next wave to come. It's been like so kind of fun. It's changed just boring swimming along in the sea because uh, you actually have to kind of like dodge waves and stuff, uh, which is pretty cool. But yesterday was a bit too rough. I kind of got pushed under the water about five times by waves and I had no idea where I was. Uh, and I was trying to swim up uh, to the surface when I was in a wave and stuff, so it was really, really confusing me, so I just thought, okay, yeah, maybe it is a bit too choppy. Uh, but yeah, it's been pretty fun by the beach, although I've not been doing too much. Uh, that's going to change today, and hopefully the day is going to get a bit more exciting from now on. So I will see you then. So then, this is my final full day, or the end of my final full day, uh, in... Nerja, uh in Spain. Uh, now I'm not going home. No, I'm not. I'm not. Obviously, I'm not going home like right away. Uh, I'm not going to the airport. Getting on the flight today. It's tomorrow. Uh, because this is my last full day. Uh, tomorrow I have to wake up at five o'clock, and then uh, it's off to the airport. Uh, to get on the flight and to return to the UK. And the UK's great climate. Cause, you know, it's always. Nice and warm, never cold. We obviously always get a summer, and we never, you know, don't get a summer at all. Obviously, ha, ha, it's great banter, but it's a shame to leave. Uh, it's quite well. It's not quite a nice place. It's a really nice place. The town's really nice, as I said last couple of days. I've been looking around that, found some like pretty nice place to have lunch. Come to Spain, and I know it's it's an Italian place. Uh, you come to Spain, you eat Italian food. I I, I don't care. It's a local restaurant that serves Italian food. I, it just does, and I don't care. It's nice. Uh, but yeah, no, it has a nice place. I would recommend it to anybody who wanted uh, to come to Spain. If you like, like, I've been to uh, Barcelona, probably the only time I've actually been to mainland Spain other than this. I went to Sitges, which uh, didn't actually realise till I got there that that's, that's the gay capital of Spain. <laughs> So, if you want to know, yeah, I went to the gay capital of Spain. Not that I'm gay, I'm really not, but didn't actually know that until I got there, but that's the only other time I've been to mainland Spain, so it wasn't, you know, a great experience. This place called Sitges, which is near Barcelona, so you ended up going into Barcelona most days. You didn't really spend too much time in Sitges. Uh, so, this is my only second time going to mainland Spain, but I've been to Mallorca and Lanzarote, which are both, like, Spanish owned or Spanish ruled places, I suppose you could say. Uh, so yeah, this is my last day, and I guess I'll show you some, you know, fancy cinematic plane shots, uh, and then I'll talk to you again when I'm back at home, back in my room. Uh, so yeah, I've probably enjoyed the holiday, and I know the vlog hasn't been full of eventful things, like I've not really gone anywhere, I've just been chilling on the beach the whole time. Uh, but I hope it has given you an insight, almost, into kind of my holiday. So, yeah, I will see you when I am back uh, in the UK and at my house. So, I'll see you then.
So guys, as you can see, I am back in the room uh, that I started in, which means I am back in the UK, I am back home. Uh, now, well that means that this is the end of uh, this kind of vlog, although it's not been amazing. I know uh, I haven't really done too much, I haven't really filmed too much, I know, but I just wanted to do something, sort of while I was away, rather than just having like, nothing just going away from the week and then just starting off kind of like normal videos I wanted to do something a bit different uh so i thought I, that i would uh so yeah i'm back in the uk so videos will kind of like resume their normal kind of like schedule i suppose even though i don't really have one uh but i'll just keep sort of like making videos as normal uh from now on uh but anyway guys as i said that is gonna be a, the end of this vlog here i hope you have enjoyed it, even though it hasn't been you know the best thing in the world i know uh but i hope you have enjoyed uh i know i had to split it into two parts because i thought it was gonna get a bit long so that's what i've done uh but yeah that's the end of the vlog i hope you have enjoyed it, and i will see you all in the next gta 5 black ops 3 or whatever video so i will see you then